Well, thanks guys. We are here in Peachtree Corners, Georgia, and this is called the Curiosity Lab. It's where companies like this, Local Motors and their Ollie, can test out vehicles that are not only autonomous, but they're both electrified and connected. The world is changing and changing at speeds unthinkable just 10 years ago. Smartphones control our lives, and smart devices like Google Home and Amazon Alexa are now controlling everything in our homes. Vehicles on the road are being driven by computers, and it's happening faster than the time it takes you to put on your seatbelt. Well, enter the Curiosity Lab in Peachtree Corners, a small town outside of Atlanta, Georgia. It's one of America's first true smart cities where computers are interacting with pedestrians on a daily basis and on local streets. The Curiosity Lab is more than just a test track, though. Technology companies, government agencies, tech startups, and more have come to Peachtree Corners to utilize the state-of-the-art power grid that has been created by Georgia Power to continue building and testing their own technology. We spoke to Brian Johnson, city manager for the city of Peachtree Corners and president of the Curiosity Lab, to learn more about it. Curiosity Lab Peachtree Corners is three things. It's a mile and a half section of roadway within an existing um, technology park. It is a 25,000 square foot incubator um, with um, innovation space located on this one and a half miles. And it's also all the technology inside of this one and a half miles that allows for any mobility, connected vehicle, smart city testing or demonstration that exists currently. To prove out the Curiosity Lab's 1.5-mile test track, they looked for a partner that has experience in building modern tech vehicles. Enter Local Motors, the company most notably known for their consumer design rally fighter off-road vehicle that hit the market a few years ago, and they have now gotten into the modern tech market. It's called Ali, and it's both fully autonomous and electrified, and it's being fully tested at Peachtree Corners on public roads. And inside the Local Motors Ollie, this is the world's first 3D designed and manufactured vehicle. But inside the tech world, however, insiders say that a true smart city is going to need to be powered by 5G connectivity to work effectively. From robots to autonomous vehicles, they need faster connection speeds that allow for decisions to be made faster than the human brain. The Curiosity Lab believes they have an answer to that. The lab is powered by new 5G technology, and they partnered with Sprint and are testing what they call True Mobile 5G. The connectivity speeds up communication between the devices while also increasing the computer computer's decision-making time significantly. The proven grounds here at the Curiosity Lab give companies like Kia a chance to test out their autonomous vehicles like the all-new Kia Habanero concept vehicle. But when they come to market, they end up like this vehicle right here, the all-new Kia Telluride, that also has forms of autonomous features. Many automakers have the opportunity to use the 1.5 mile track at the Curiosity Lab to fine tune their vehicles for longer periods of driving without human control. Showcased at the grand opening of the lab in late 2019, Kia showed off their Habanero concept vehicle on site, which is a super futuristic look at what technology holds with electrification and level five autonomy. The technology showcased on concept vehicles like the Habanero actually make their way onto vehicles that are on the road today, like the Kia Telluride, which has level two autonomy that allows for short bursts of hands-free driving. With the Curiosity Lab here in Peachtree Corners, it gives companies like this, Local Motors, a chance to truly test out their autonomous vehicles. I'm Mike Caudill.